and testing out my new laser light again um which i didn't really get into too much depth with it yesterday um but okay so as i said laser flashlight strobe strobing laser which I, I think it's a little too light out right now to test out the theory uh i, I think i am gonna have to get a little bit closer to the targets Which, okay. I am getting some of the laser. Ooh, got that one. Is that it for the clip? Yes, and I broke the clay pigeon that I'm actually shooting for, but I am getting some laser sighting on it. Wait, they say with an hour charge, I think they said you could get about five hours with it. But uh, I think I also forgot, um, you get about five hours of actual airplay, um, which I did take one clay pigeon down, um, which was, right over there. Which, like I said, I wanted to show you a little bit of that. Um, which, like I said, I, I am actually going to step away from here for a little bit. Plus, I'm actually going to go recharge. I'm actually going to stay right here and I'm going to reload real quick. Which, like I said, I, I do really want, and that clip is not wanting to to tell us in right now. So, Which, thank God for that. Son of a fuck. Which, you should always treat these guns as something that could absolutely hurt somebody. So always take that into consideration that this is a weapon, but it's not a gun. It's a BB. And it could come into a self-defense tool if you need it to be. Which I'm not saying I need it to be right now. All right. Good 
take that off. So, just gonna load up the clip or the magazine. Just gonna try for my second target. I think soon I'm going to have to change the CO2, which, thank God, I have that. Okay. Uh, at least I know the laser's working. And... Like I said, I've showed you this over and over. CO2, back pocket. Allen wrench, right there. Okay, and that was a good one. Which, just to let you guys know, I'm actually using the Umarex, um 12 gram CO2 a uh, little bit on the smaller side but you do get your use out of it like it's pretty decent for a day um, which now I got two two regular CO2 cartridges that are empty which I do keep in my side CO2 clip um, co compartment or my uh, BB compartment from for my clip. Which, as I said, I'm going to show you guys a little bit on how to do this. Goes in like so. There's the clip, or there's it sliding in. And as soon as you hear this, that means you just punctured the CO2 and it's ready to go. going to go get another round ready, um, which I, I generally like to have my rounds ready, but I think I'm going to probably go through probably 50 to 75 rounds. Or six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and another three to go in. Which this magazine actually takes sixteen rounds. Uh, I think the Glock 17 Gen 3 BB gun takes 18, up to 18. All right, so. Okay. 
Okay. So. Okay. I missed on everything. Which, at least I know I'm getting... Within general radius of it. Um, three. Which I am a horrible shot. Because, as I said, I, I'm basically a new learner. At five. So I got half a clip. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Okay, so, um, yeah, not trying to blind anybody. Which, like I said, um, I am going to try to hit a couple on my own. Um, which I, I did hit that one a good four out of the 16, so I'm about 25%. Um, on that, I think it was four out of four or 16. Because I know I hit it tw at least three times. So, like I said, I, I am going to try to go round for round. With the next uh, five or four or three. Which I gotta say, the laser is kind of on point. But, like I said, I am actually going to try to get more of it right here. Which, I think I'm going to probably come over here. Like I said, I am going to try to take a couple of rounds right here, relatively close, just to show you guys how there's that light. I'm going to just take a couple of rounds from up close.
like I said, I did want to demonstrate a little bit of that to you guys. Um, which, like I said, you've got your... LED flasher. guys can see right there that's green and you got the flasher light flashlight flashlight um i, I definitely do like the it's uh, the new accessory i have for it um which like i said i i am trying to do more videos like this um just to inform you that on how things work with it uh, I think the laser actually works pretty decent. I, I think I would have to wait till it gets a little bit darker to really try it. Because it does get a little bit more distant when it gets darker. Um, so, that being said, I'm going to take a step back. And I'm going to say thank you guys for being a part of this stream. I'm Joshua Danger. Stay safe. Shoot straight. And stay positive, guys. Good night. Peace. I'm out.